I just woke up. I mean, I, I got dressed. I'm about to go downstairs and get some breakfast, but I am still very tired. Um, I slept like 12 hours, but mind you, I only got 12 hours of sleep the night before. No, two hours of sleep the night before, um, Friday night. So I really needed to make up for it. And I don't think I made all of it up. I think I made a lot of it up, but not all of it. <laughs> okay, I'm about to go to a place called Seaville Square, which is kind of like a park. Um, I know it has a lot of trees, so you're welcome, Kat, because you're about to see some pretty cool scenery. Uh, so here we go. Alright, so I am in Seaville Square. As you can see, there's lots of trees, um, so Kat would really enjoy that. There's something really peaceful about it. I don't know. Um, but there's like nobody here. Like at all. There's lots of squirrels though. And naps. Okay, so I'm now back at the hotel, but I wanted to tell you what happened from the time that I left the bird park uh, on my way home. So, when I pulled out of the parking lot from the bird park, I noticed that there were cars at a standstill, and then when I looked down, I saw people wearing these blue shirts like kind of in the middle of the road and I was thinking oh it's probably a protest you know whatever well the closer I got because somebody let me into the road I realized that on the right side 
was a thrift store and all of the employees were outside. And on the left, there were these two kind of buffer guys. And then there was a man that did not have a shirt on and did not have pants on. And the very first time that I looked over, his under his boxers had kind of fallen down. He kept trying to take them off. And then I guess the guys convinced him to put them back on, so he put them back on. And then this lady ran out of the laundromat and was like super pissed and like yelling at him. And then some other like older lady came out and was like yelling at him. And it was very intense. He was obviously intoxicated off of something. I don't know what substance that is, whether it's legal, illegal, alcohol, whatever drugs I have no idea but that was that was fun that was interesting um, definitely a huge highlight of my trip